Duke Grant Sports Magazine presents UCYFL Football. Today's matchup is the 11U Bel Air Terps Ray versus the 11U Perry Hall Gators Gold. As you can see, this game is going to be a grinder. Both teams are looking to get back into the playoff hunt. And here, you see number 24 of the Bel Air Terps trying to get some needed yardage. The ball went back over to the Gators, but they too had their troubles. As you see, the quarterback sack. Here, number 81 goes up top to number 11. He looks like he's got some room, and he goes down over the 40-yard line. Now, this quarterback, number 81, he looks like he likes going up top as he finds number four for the screen. But he's going to learn that when you come to Tucker Field, you can't just hold the ball like a statue because they're going to come at you as you see number 25 getting the sack. Now the set offense of the Bel Air Terps. As you see, they go inside the 68. He looks like he's bottled up. No, he shoots out of there like a rocket. He is gone. Touchdown, number 68, Bel Air Turk. What a beautiful play. He looked like he was dead to right. Watch this in slow-mo as he comes through this line. He comes bulletin through here like, look, y'all, I'm coming through. So y'all better either get out of my way or get ran over. Woo, look at it. And once he gets that little bit of time, he gets, the, he gets like a step on him. He's like, sorry, buddy. I'm gone. Touchdown, number 68, Bel Air Turks. But after all that, it was a penalty that didn't count. So Bel Air got the ball back again. This time going to the air. Beautiful play by number 11 of Perry Hall trying to break it up. But Bel Air said, no, I'm going up top again. And here he does. And he finds his man, number 21, for the touchdown. Beautiful play by the Turks. That's what I'm talking about. You can't get discouraged. You got to just keep on putting your foot right back on that gas. And good things are happening. The extra point is good. And the Turks now lead 13 to nothing. Now the Gators have the ball back. Number 81. He goes back to the air. And he sees he's got number four. I like a quarterback that's daring like this. I like this guy. He likes to do. He likes to put it up there. Here again. See how he goes up. This time, pass interference. He's challenging this Bel Air Turks team. He's challenging them to stop him. He keeps going back to the air. Here, number two. Beautiful move. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Touchdown, number two. Oh, was that pretty? He's got some. He's got some. Fred Astaire, Sammy Davis Jr., and Michael Jackson all hooked up into one. Watch this move as he puts on these guys from Bel Air. They're all around him. He says, "Whoa, no! Oh, you can't do nothing with this. Where you? And great block by number 77, springing my man all the way to the end zone." That's how you do it, ladies and gentlemen. Number two, touchdown. And the extra point is no good. So the score now, Perry Hall cuts the lead right before halftime to 13 to six. As the second half began, the Turks look like they want to control this clock. It looked like they want to just keep it on the ground. You see it grinding. Just trying to move the chains. Their whole body of work looks like they're just trying to keep it going. But this is a tough Perry Hall team. And they're hanging right in there with them. Here you see an interception. Great interception. And the Gators have the ball back. 
And you see the quarterback. Great pass, great catch by number four. Watch as 81 goes back again. This time he gets it back to number two. The fleet of foot. And he gets just a couple. Now 81 again, going up top. This time to number three. Nice nifty move by these gentlemen. But the ball goes back to the turf. And they're going to try to play some power football. They say about speed, there is no substitute. Number 84, looks like he's going to go all the way for a touchdown. Beautiful play by number 84. He just looked like he just took off like he was a shot out of a cannon. Like a rocket. Watch here as he takes off. And once they get the angle on him, looks like one guy falls. With that speed that he had, he just turned on them afterburners and said, You know what? You're not going to catch me now today. Touchdown number 85. Taking it to the house. Any extra point? It's going to be a run. So it looks like the Perry Hall Gator smelled it out. And it's no good. Making the score 19 to 6. Bel Air Turks. Here you see Perry Hall. Still trying to get something happen. But nothing doing by number 36. Great defensive play. And a little bit of posture. Now it looks like the defenses are tightening back up. There's not a whole lot happening. Needs to provide the spot. And it's number 24. Woo! Looking like Gail saying. Go ahead, boy. Woo! Look at him. All the way down to the 10-yard line. Beautiful run. Watch this run. See how he got that hole? And then watch he just move. Put the move on number 11 like he was just standing still. And then another move saying, look, boy, I got some get nice with me. One proud looking like prime. And here you see 84 barreling in. But the Turks stalled on in Gator territory. Giving the ball back to the Gators. He tried to get out of deep in their end zone, but they just couldn't. Had some pretty good runs, as you see here, number four. Getting it out to some decent field position, but never really threatening again. Here you see number four again. Moving, trying to make something happen. And number four again. But this time, pop by number 83. But in the end, too much turks. As you see, number 84 get the interception. That ends the contest. Thanks for watching. And remember, if you can't attend the game, you might as well watch it with the Duke. Duke Grant Sports Magazine. Home of the very baddest young dudes in sports.